I don't want to get it wrong. And I know it's real easy to get it wrong. So tell us about Spousely and what it is, because you're very particular about how we describe (laughs) Spousely. I am. So Spousely is an online marketplace to shop a wide variety of both products and services, all created by military and first responder families. So I like to call it Etsy meets Angie's List, but with a focus on shopping for social good Mm -hmm. and supporting our nation's heroes. And and not just military, military spouses, yep. but also first responders, anyone really in that service kind of community. Yeah, that's what's so magical about the platform is we're partnered with GovX, so they handle all of our verification to make sure our vendors are approved military spouses, service mm-hmm. members, gold star families, first responders, active duty service members, spouses, and yeah, just everybody that is supporting and serving our country. Yeah, it's it's a wonderful idea. It's so exciting you've brought it to fruition and where it is today. How did it start, though? Whew, that's a loaded question, so I'll give you the the quick answer. So it all stemmed out of my own pure frustration and inspiration as a military spouse myself. Um, I know this journey is something you're very familiar with, but I'll give you everyone a little bit of a recap. So military families usually relocate on average every two to three years. Um, you know, we're faced with the unknown. We don't really know what's coming next, frequent deployments, and the list goes on. And as a military spouse, it's really hard. Oftentimes we have to take the backseat on our own personal dreams and goals. And um, it, it becomes challenging where you end up thinking, who am I? What am I doing? What can I do to piece this puzzle together? And I started to realize how many just amazing businesses were owned by our nation's heroes. And I'm talking millions, millions Mm -hmm. of businesses. And there wasn't one central location for people to go and shop and support our nation's heroes. So started doing my market research Mm -hmm. and I was like, you know what, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to create a platform that brings everyone together. And it's it's more than just a place to shop. It's truly that community supporting supporting one another, no matter where the military or first responder life takes us. Yeah, I think it. I think that gets lost in the shuffle a little bit. We we appreciate the service of folks who are on active duty first responders, but we we don't always remember unless you're involved in it. Yeah, we don't always remember the contribution that the the spouses and the kids and the the families make, and I think that's really important. I think. I think it's great that someone, you, have taken a step to bring that to the forefront. I think, that, I think that's wonderful. And, and you know better than I do what the military <laughs> spouse employment statistics are like. They, yeah. are, they can be pretty grim sometimes. Yeah, sadly, it's been 24% for nearly a decade, and that number only continues to rise. And that's it's exactly what I said. You know, it's really hard to piece the puzzle together. And oftentimes, companies don't understand that. Um, it's really sad that it took COVID for more companies to see that you can work remote and have a su- successful career. I am proof of that. I had a very awesome and co- uh, amazing corporate career working full-time remote, making a great salary. But I started to see that a lot of my fellow spouses just weren't able to figure something out like that. So we're, we're making steps in the right direction. But entrepreneurship is great because it you know bridges the gap to doing what you love while living a life on the go. Yeah, it it's an option that even when I was in the military, I, I retired almost 10 years ago. Yeah. Um, it wasn't something we talked about for military spouses. We, th- there are a lot of, there are opportunities for jobs for military spouses, but not always opportunities for careers. And entrepreneurship yeah. is a great way to build a career yeah, if you absolutely. are in that position. So. Yeah, I'm a big believer, you know, if you can just do what you love and have fun doing it, but, you know, also being rewarded for everything that we also go through on a life, you know, standpoint as well, you can never stop growing personally or professionally. And I always say when one person serves, the entire family Absolutely. serves as well. Yeah, so you did your market research, <laughs> you started looking at it as a, as a good MBA yeah. would, right? So <laughs> was there a catalyst where you decided to pull the trigger on Spousely? You know, I had a small business on the side of my corporate career and I was selling on Etsy. And I just remember thinking with a platform like Etsy, what was really unique about it was the community, was that feel of being around like-minded individuals. So I knew what it felt like and I knew you know, what it was to be selling and having a business around other people that just get it. Mm -hmm. And so I really kind of took that business model and I applied, you know, the layer of supporting our nation's heroes on it. So it's not like it's rocket science where I was recreating the wheel on anything. Mm -hmm. It's a proven concept, but now, you know, supporting a truly deserving community. Yeah, my my notes say there was something about a car trip. (laughs) Oh, that is the best. How how the idea of Spousely came up. Yes. So I was headed to dinner with a 
a few fellow military spouses and we were in one car all going together and I was like you know what there's so much talent in just this one car you're a private investigator you're a photographer you make coffee I love business like why are we all not doing more together and how can we support one another and so I just remember always saying to my friends that's so spousely of you just because uh. <laughs> I was always just inspired by you know their way to to put a smile on someone else's face, whether it was bringing them homemade coffee or, you know, just that special gift. So that's so spousely of you came top of mind. 